This is Motorola Moto G23 and today I would like to demonstrate that you can set up parental controls on this device. So to begin with you will need to launch settings, onwards enter Google category. In here make sure that there are no accounts currently added to your system, if there are any you just tap at the Google account, <clears throat> then go for the manage accounts on this device option and remove each Google account you have linked one by one like so. Once this step is out of the way, you can re-enter the Google uh, section, go for the parental controls, in here tap at the get started, child routine, next. Onwards, go for the add or create account for a child option and either sign into the Google account of your child or sign up for one if you haven't any. So I happen to have one on my hands ready to be used. So enter the Gmail address, then enter the password at the following page. Onward, tap at the I agree button. Proceed with the Google login as you would normally do. Then uh, select the account that you have just logged into from the list over here. And start entering the credentials, this time for the parent's Google account. Or for the Google account that you as a parent or supervisor will use for monitoring and setting up child's uh, phone activity. So. Enter email, enter password, you know the drill. In here, at the very bottom of the following page, enter the password to the child's Google account one more time. Tap at the agree button. Then at the following pop-up window, go for the allow. Wait for the child and parent accounts to get linked. then click next. In here you can turn off uh, some of the apps and restrict an app access to your child, but you will be also able to do that later on. So if you would like to finish the setup procedure sooner, you can just simply skip this step. The same uh, more or less applies for filters, settings and uh, age restrictions management. From here, if the device that is written in the bold font is the one that you'll use as a parent for supervising your child's activity, you can just tap at the blue button and get the required app automatically downloaded and installed on your supervisor's phone. Or you can also just skip the step, uh, take your uh, phone as a supervisor and manually download and install the family link app from Google Play Store. In my case, this device uh, happens to be the one that I was planning to use as a supervisor. So once I tap at the button, the needed app should get automatically downloaded and installed. As you can see, it, it, it is actually currently being downloaded and installed on my device. So at this point, all the uh, procedures needed at the child's end were successfully set up and finished. So take your uh, parental phone open the family link app make sure to sign in with the google account you have earlier identified as parents over here make sure to choose the correct google account and inside the family link application you can set daily uh, usage limits uh, decide whether your child will have the downtime routine or not turn on and turn off some of the apps as well as monitor uh, the child's app activity Apply content restrictions for such services as Google Play, YouTube, Google Chrome, Google Search, or perhaps Google Assistant. Configure the account settings. Uh, manage devices. See and check your child's location at any given time as soon as you have uh, granted uh, an location access at the child's end. It's child's device and should I rather say and see the uh, device usage highlights for your child already so that would be it as far as setting up parental controls goes we highly appreciate your attention thanks for your time and bye bye